Here's your WNEM TV 5 news update. Good morning, everyone. I'm Blake Keller. Here's a look at the top stories we're following today. One of the FBI's most wanted has been arrested in Grand Blank. 68, 68 year old Leonard Moses had been on the run for nearly 50 years. Now his conviction stemmed from a crime in 1968 when he and some friends threw a Molotov cocktail at a home in Pittsburgh, burning a woman inside who later died. Now the FBI in Pittsburgh says Moses escaped in 1971 while attending his grandmother's funeral. He assumed a new identity under the name Paul Dixon. Since 1999, he was employed as a traveling pharmacist in Michigan. In January, Moses was arrested under that assumed name on accusations of embezzlement when his fingerprints were entered into a nationwide database. That's when the FBI discovered they belonged to Moses, leading to his arrest. Moses remains jailed in Genesee County, awaiting extradition to Pennsylvania. And Covenant Healthcare has a new COVID-19 testing center. The drive through testing center at the Covenant Hospital in Saginaw can be accessed off Fayette Street. Those who come for testing must have a doctor's order. Results are expected within two to four days. And a local women's group hoping to provide every child with a winter coat. Today, Women of Colors will be hosting its seventh annual Warm a Child for Winter event. They will be passing out new and gently used coats, hats, and gloves at a drive through giveaway. It's at 9 this morning at the SBRC on Tuscola Street in Saginaw. Now here's John with a look at your forecast. Blake, thank you. Here's a look at your TV5 weather update for today. Not too bad. I think we start off your Saturday with plenty of sunshine. Increasing clouds, though, by the time we reach later on this afternoon. Overall temperatures today reaching back into the 40s. For the rest of tonight, rain chances and your winds do increase. Temperatures overall falling near 40, but those numbers will slowly rise as we go into the early hours of your Sunday morning. If you're going to be heading out to the woods tomorrow for opening day, here's a look at your hunting forecast. We'll have plenty of rain, chances for some snow showers in the mix, and it's going to be breezy. Winds will be on the south and west sustained at about 20 to 30 miles per hour, gusts at times reaching 40 plus. Temperatures in the morning starting at around 50 and falling throughout the 40s into Sunday afternoon. For the seven day forecast, we continue with slight chances for some rain and snow showers Monday and Tuesday. Temperatures into the 30s and the 40s. Drying things out, it looks like by midweek, and we'll continue with the dry stretch into next weekend with a slight warm up by Thursday and Friday. Temperatures back near 50 degrees. On the first one five weather center, I'm meteorologist John Gross. Remember to tune into WNEM TV 5 on air and online 24 7 for the latest news, weather, and information.